48. An unbeaten season. 15 straight victories and another championship. Now, a lot of people always associate the perfect season with the Miami Dolphins, but the Browns had the perfect season back in 1948. And honestly, it is one of the most impressive runs of football the franchise ever had, because when you look back on it, it was largely a breeze. There weren't a lot of fourth quarter comebacks and there was a lot of lopsided results. The one that stands out maybe the most uh, was week 13. The Browns needed an 11 point second half comeback to beat San Francisco to move to 13 and 0 and making it more impressive. It was their third game in eight days. So it's a really small stretch where they had to pack a lot of football in and just keep on winning. The trip started in New York, then continued on the West Coast. Unlike the NFL, the AAFC had teams on the West Coast. So travel was an often difficult drawn out ordeal. Traveling from Cleveland to LA took you 24 hours. We had four motor planes go from Cleveland to Chicago, Chicago to Denver, and Denver down to LA. Welcome aboard, Cleveland Brown. We'll fly at 10,000 feet with a speed of 230 miles an hour. I know we'll have a nice trip. One time we were playing LA, coming out of Denver, all the fat guys sat in the back of the plane, see? And it, you got to go up over those mountains. It took us an hour in that B-24 to go up over the mountain. So they finish the season 14 and 0, and no doubt about it, they go into the championship game and absolutely rout the Buffalo Bills to claim their third straight AAFC championship and truly solidify themselves as the dominant team in the AAFC.